is going to cover the cutter. The wing is going to hit the corner and cut through, and then you're going to have to replace them. You're going to have to replace, and you replace, and, and he'll end up in the corner. We'll do that a couple times. Now, here's the rule for that. As he hits and cuts through, you're going to cut through with him and honor him. And then he gets here and then trade him off. Let him go. He stays here and plugs, which means you got to back up. All right? Now, the pass comes back out again to your man. You've got to come back out and attack. You've got to get to your elbow. All right? We come back up to the other point, goes over the other wing, and then he cuts through. And you just take him for two or three steps, check him off, talk like you got him, Joe, whatever the hell it is. And when the pass comes back out to your man, you go back up again and uh, attack the ball. See the ball, see the ball, see the ball. Good, good. So again, as he hits and he cuts, he, the role what he's trying to do is to cut through to get some activity so when they swing it, he's on the other side. But a lot of smart teams will do this. If you stay here and, and cut, I, I, I pass the ball, face to face there, and I cut, just say you stay, see, so they'll stop. And then they got to play. Then what do we do? So that's why you have to honor, honor the cutter. But you don't have to be you know, hip to hip with them.